products. And that's really, really important because over the years, milkweed, which used to be in lots of farmers' fields, really hasn't, I mean, because of the way we uh, do agriculture now, there aren't as many weeds, there's not as much milkweed, and it has really hit the monarchs very hard. Populations are being decimated. So out of everything that we plant, in our garden, I think this is the most important if you want to help those monarchs. Six pieces of the Asclepius Butterfly Bouquet. We're giving you all six for three easy payments of $7.26. It makes it $3 and change a piece for a plant that's not only beautiful, but really, really important. So I want to, we're going to say hi to Stephanie Walleen from Roberta's, and but I want to show you exactly quickly. I'm going to come over here and I'll show you what you get. You get six plants and our six plants are right over here so it really is a tremendous value and then they're going to start to bloom and this is a real flower and this is what the asclepius that you're going to grow looks like but for the first time you're getting this rainbow effect with asclepius we even have white asclepius which is new to me and traditionally asclepius or milkweed is i mean it's amazing for the monarchs but it's not the best garden plant like it's not the prettiest this is the better asclepius so the monarchs will love it but you're really going to love it too um, i want to quickly show you i grew roberta's asclepius last year this collection's even better though so i'm getting it but i want to show you what happened in my yard last year i noticed shortly after i got it there were little eggs i brought those eggs indoors they turned into caterpillars there's my caterpillar going into um, its chrysalis and then here it is two weeks later about 10 days later that monarch butterfly came out of that chrysalis and then we released them in my yard and we did it, oh gosh, we probably got about two dozen uh, butterflies because we did it several times. And you do not have to go through all the trouble we went through, it was a project for me and my kids, but just by planting the Asclepius in your yard, that's really all you have to do to do your part to help with the monarch butterfly situation. I do have an update for you. Already this season, over 11,000 have been ordered. And we don't have that many more to go around. In fact, this is our final order of the season. I want to say hello to Stephanie Walleen, who is actually more passionate about this than even I am, and I'm crazy about this idea. Stephanie is here from Roberta's. Stephanie, I want to thank you for really doing your part to help save the monarch butterflies. Well, and I want to thank you, Sandra. I unfortunately don't have such a cool video, <laughs> but it's my goal this summer to make one. Um, and you said it so well, you know, we love our flowers and our and our plants, but if there's just one plant that I think everybody should really try to grow this year, it is this, this Asclepius. Because as you explained so well, Sandra, this is the only plant, and I, I'm not pulling your leg, this is the only plant that the monarch butterfly will go and lay its eggs. Mm -hmm. And then once those hatch into the caterpillars, which when you see them on your plant, make sure you leave them there, because this is the leaves that those caterpillars will eat and then eventually they will you know, go into their chrysalis and emerge into those gorgeous monarch butterflies. So quite literally by planting this, whether you have you know, a large estate or just a town home or an apartment, by, doing, by planting this, you are doing your part in saving the monarch butterfly population, which unfortunately in just the last 20 years has declined by 80%. So and sad. the monarch butterfly, it is actually on the candidacy list now to become an endangered species. Mm -hmm. So, you know, by, for many reasons, there, this Asclepius or milkweed has, you know, in the wild started to go away. So now by planting these in your yards, in your containers, in the backyard, you are doing your part in helping save the monarch butterfly. So, gosh, that is so sad, right? 80% uh, of the population has disappeared. Number. It's really just because of the way we, agric we do agriculture now and loss of mm -hmm. habitat. And, but here's what's good news. If I have Asclepius and you have Asclepius and Stephanie has Asclepius and all over the country, you'll give those monarch yes. butterflies a place to land as they make that migration from North America, exactly. all over North America into Mexico. They need spots to land. So it means I can't just have it. You have to have it too. Um, and Stephanie, mm -hmm. here's why I think everyone should get Roberta's. Let's start with the fact that last year I did several cycles of raising butterflies and I ended up needing more Asclepius. I went to my local right. garden center last August. I spent 10 or $11 on the scrawniest plant. It wasn't nearly as pretty. And we're getting mm -hmm. six plants here for $3 and change yes. a piece with free shipping and handling. It's a much better price to get it from us. And let's talk about the fact that this is a much better Asclepius for our garden. Totally. Yeah, Sandra, you know, 
we want to bring the feast for the monarch butterfly and the caterpillars, but we also want to bring a feast for our eyes and our senses. So this collection of Asclepias is a hybrid, which means, you know, traditional milkweed can grow like six to eight feet tall. It's kind of leggy and, and strung out. The monarch butterflies don't mind, but it's not that pretty for us. So we brought this collection. It's only going to grow about three feet tall and three feet wide when it's mature. And it's, you're going to get three different colors, two of each. And I would love to go back through those images to see them um, because the colors are very beautiful. So you're going to be enjoying growing these That's Asclepias the up front. This is the revered Ice Ballet White. You know, it's very rare to find a white Asclepias. It's just stunning. It's like, you know, it, it truly shines. And once the monarch butterflies come and find it, I mean, to see that in your own yard, imagine doing a build to ship to and sending it. There's the caterpillar. To kids. Exactly, the kids in their family and teaching them about the caterpillars and the oh, whole process. Oh, my kids process. loved it. Yeah, my kids absolutely loved it. And then you'll get two of the pink. It's yes, a very this pretty is, collection. This is the Cinderella pink. And again, you're getting two of each of these colors. So, you know, if you can at this value, I would recommend picking up two collections. My Uncle Court likes to say he plants one kind of at the back of his property where the butterflies will just, you know, go wild and have fun. And then he plants another collection up front by his deck so that he can watch and enjoy the butterflies yeah. fluttering in and out. And, and it's not just the monarchs. I was just gonna say, totally. it's not just the monarchs, there's a swallowtail. Yes. So other butterflies exactly. like this too, but unlike other butterflies that might also eat other types of plants, only mm -hmm. Asclepius can be eaten by the monarchs. It's the only place they lay exactly. their eggs. Um, in fact, actually, maybe we can show that video again so you can understand. I would love to when see you, it. Um, if you go outside and you see little eggs, generally they'll be on the underside. Okay, so those are that's a caterpillar I took in my house. There it's in my kitchen turning into its chrysalis. That's time lapse. Mm -hmm. It took a bit. It took like a cup, several minutes. And then 10 days later, those caterpillars, wow. when their chrysalis came out as monarch butterflies, and then we were able to release them. And that's my husband holding it on his finger and I'm releasing them. We did several cycles last year and it was so special for our family. I mean, it was like my Super Bowl. Every day I checked, is it out of the chrysalis yet? That is awesome. It, it, it was a little work, but we loved it. The thing is, you don't have to do that. We just did it because I mean, yeah. what else were we doing? We didn't travel last well, summer. Sandra, but, but just by growing these, Stephanie, right? Just by growing these, you can do your part. And it's so important. Exactly. And that's what I wanted to say. First off, I want to say thank you for doing your part because I know how passionate you are about help, helping save the monarch butterfly population. And like you said, you know, if I grow this in San Diego, and you know, anybody in the country can grow this. I should remind you of that, you know, it's super winter hardy. So if you live up at the Canadian border, you also can grow this collection and do your part. Because like you said, by growing these Clepius, you're giving the monarch butterflies somewhere to go when they're making their migration. And you're giving them truly their home and also their meal, because this is the only leaf that those caterpillars are going to munch on and then eventually, you know, go through the chrysalis and turn into those gorgeous monarch butterflies. I love this price point. Okay, so here's this why this collection. Like, I'm very passionate about the monarch butterflies, mm -hmm. and I credit Stephanie last year talking a lot about that and getting me all jazzed up about Thank it. Thank you. It added so much fun to our summer last year. But here's why you want to get it here because yes. first of all it's a better it's a better setup you're getting two white two pink two orange mm -hmm. if you're someone who loves gardening you know that if you go even now to the garden center they're going to charge you i mean i paid it was like 10 or 11 dollars for one scrawny plant we're giving you a better variety and you're getting them home for three dollars and change a piece and here's what our plants look like so you're going to get six of these they will very rapidly start blooming they give you mm -hmm. months of color and then the perennials they'll come back next they year are. if you do want exactly. to do auto delivery auto delivery will send another set out to you the following year not because these won't still be alive but because once you do this you're going to want more 1500 totally. have now been ordered stephanie thank you so much thank you sandra such a great price. Oh, here's something coming up. In just about 10 minutes.